Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hello, good morning guys Let me introduce myself My name is Jenbi Rosela Agusin Elbas And you can call me with Senbi I'm a student from English Education Department In third semester at STKIP Muhammadiyah Muara Bungu So, in this video I would like to show you about my presentation news this video I made for complete my assignment or my task in academic speaking by my lectures, Memfirawati MPD. In this video, I would like to show you about the viral video that happened in social media. So, if you're curious about my video, let's check the video in the next. Don't forget to give your thumbs up and don't forget for Follow and sus subscribe this channel too. Thank you. Happy watching. <music> Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello audience. Good morning. I hope you are in a good condition. It's an honor for me to stand in front of you to deliver a presentation with me, San Mirosala, in a breaking news in a five minute. Our topic today is about student from University of Solo died after joining training of Resimen Mahasiswa in 36th batch of University of Solo. <laughs> A student from University of Solo reportedly died after a joint men while training in the campus. This accident happened on Sunday, 24 October 2021, yesterday. It's known as Initial GA, is one of 12 participants who has joined this Resident Masses for training 36 batch which lasts for 9 days later. GA is one of D4 Occupational Safety and Health students in University of Solo Vocational School. It's suspected that there are some factors that influence the death of this student. The main factor is about violence that happening when the training behind, because the police also found that there are some bruises in his body. The second suspect is about his immunity when joining this training. Maybe he was sick or not on good condition at that time. No. The report of his death is on process of investigate by police. Nah, ini kita mendengar kabar bahwa ada salah satu mahasiswa NS yang tiba-tiba uh, dilaporkan sudah tidak bernyawa. Nah, ini untuk penyebabnya sedang kita lakukan penyelidikan. Kita sedang kita memintakan keterangan-keterangan terkait dengan kegiatan-kegiatan yang dilakukan sepanjang uh, dua hari, dua hari, dua hari ya, dari Sabtu dan In addition, the police have also conducted a gram scan or TKP as well as the place of training in the Juruk area, Solo City. Because the entire seri series of investigation is still ongoing, the police not be able to determine the cause of GA death until the autopsy report given to him. Finally, the training will be held on nine days now has been stopped since the accident happened. Alright audience, from the news above we can get the conclusion that the factor of GA death is not to be able to confirm because we still waiting for the autopsy of RSUD Dr. Mawardi solo result. So, we hope that the same accident is not happening again in the next time. So, ladies and gentlemen, that is my presentation today. I'm very sorry if any mistake in my presentation. And thank you for your attention. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. I'm Senbi Rosella. See you next time in the next breaking news.